Hello my Sock Universe for another uh, jersey collection video today. I'm wearing Spurs. I want to go show you another Premier League uh, site. You saw it already in the description. I'm wearing currently Spurs and this is M Jose Mourinho's current team as of this recording. <laughs> no, but he, he will still be long. And we look at the jersey of his previous team, which is of course Manchester United. Um, that I have a Manchester United jersey is a little bit funny because um, for the longest time I really did not want Manchester United to win the Premier League and so on. And I have to say I always... Manchester United was one of those, those teams that I never really got behind. I was never a fan of Manchester United. I could appreciate what they're doing. They had some great showings but uh, to, 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 to be honest I was never a fan except for the 99 final when they were playing against Bayern because Bayern is the bigger evil. However, uh, since I have this channel, A, things get a little bit less uh, serious, B, I think every collection should have a Manchester United shirt at least one. And to be honest, it is not that easy to find one that I find um, how to say satisfying enough for me a Manchester United shirt itself should be mostly red I mean this maybe has even too too too, too much white but I, I'd rather have it a little bit with white accents and let a little bit loose on the black one so that's why the last year's jersey although I didn't dislike it it was not the, the right thing either there were some nice Adidas jerseys but in the end I again went to the flea market page and I found this one which is from a 2010-11 season the one where they reached a Champions League final, they were not wearing this one, but you know, they became also champions. So, I mean, it's a successful jersey of theirs, and I have to say, it is a nice one. Yes, we can talk about the white collar, but I actually like the white collar and then the white here. The big design feature, if you like, is this taping here along the sides, and interestingly, it then changes color. So, here the uh, lower line is uh, black. And on the other side of the sleeve, instead of the lower line, we get here a little devil. And this was one feature that I actually liked that we have the little devil here. Also, I want to have a full color crest where I was surprised that it actually was in this little uh, shield in there. The Aeon sponsor is not my favorite. I really would have liked one from the 90s. I, I think I saw the one for, for the 98 season for around 30 euros and was really close to uh, buying it. But then this one for uh, 9 euros <laughs> wins out just because of the price. Um, and I have to say for a Nike jersey it's really nice. The tail actually is black of this jersey. We have the dry fit marking here and of course it's an authentic product. It's in really good condition. And the coolest thing is not, oh, not the MUFC but I don't know if you can make it out, but there is a slight shadow pattern in there. It's some um, chevrons that go all the way down. They become a little bit slimmer as further down it goes, kind of a ventilation uh, pattern. I really, really like that one, I have to say, for a Manchester United jersey. It's a pretty nice one, I have to say. So I'm, I'm quite happy that I have this one. Um, I honestly have to, have to say, although I want Liverpool to win and maybe I'm a little bit more in the Liverpool camp on the divide, rather neutral to be honest, nah, at the moment, a little bit more Liverpool, I actually want Manchester United to be a good team because, you know, even though they're the villain, it's better to have a villain that is good uh, and a big fight than uh, the other way around and at the moment uh, Manchester City is too, uh, turning out to be a villain, which, yeah, it's not quite the same thing. United should be up there. Same thing goes like for Bayern and Milan. It's always better. But, uh, Milan is a team that I love. So uh, I'll say uh, Inter or Juve. It's always good to have a villain that is there that you can support. And Manchester United is such an iconic team that I always feel a little bit not right when they're not finishing uh, top four, even top three. That's where they actually do belong. I mean, if they're one season uh, um, a little bit worse, I'm not mad about it. But yeah, you get the point of what I mean. So I actually wish that they turned her around, become a little bit more successful, become a squad to be reckoned with again. And then, yeah, 
I don't want to say I'm then I can start to hate again because I really I find myself I'm not hating teams anymore uh, there's a like there's a dislike but the hate factor has decreased by a lot so that's why I'm saying make them a little bit better again and get take it from there anyway I'm babbling too much let me know what you think about this jersey uh, any likes or dislikes give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video also tell me if you have some memories attached with that one as I said they made it to the Champions League final wearing this jersey. Give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and I will talk to you soon. Bye. Hey there. I really hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, here are some videos and playlists that you might enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel as it will give you all the updates, all things that rotate in my soccer universe. And with that, I'm going to wish you a very good day. Bye.